Okay. Explosives are armed again. It's judgment day for tanks. Like so. So. Oh yeah, and those turrets too. <laughs> I am drunk with power. Ah, let's see, we already uncovered one truck containing ammunition. Some of these others should also have some useful stuff. Okay, what's our next mission? Uh oh, I think I remember it. Guardian guns. And look, all that red haze is gone now. Oops. It's gonna take all day to cut through that armor. Damn, I, I don't know how to get you a clean shot. Right. Lucky for us, I brought my trusty can opener. Commander, meet Sergeant C4. Drop of cash and let him blow them up. Sounds good to me. But before we do that, uh, okay, yeah, recording. I uh do want to go around doing some housekeeping on the outer edges first. Above all, take out those T90 tanks. The third supply drop is now on the west side of the palace. How did they manage to make one supply drop within the walls of the fortress? Uh, ours is not the question why, ours is to do and cause the enemy to die. Oh, fuel. At least two of those surviving T90 tanks are without turrets. Now I am going over, over here to the middle of nowhere in search of something quite specific, and I do believe that why it's. No, it's not. It should be somewhere around here. Further to the south, I think. Ah, I believe this is it. Hokum discovered. Oh, KA-52 come off. Now, this is a fancy little Russian toy. There's actually, uh, I think, something like 20 or 30 in existence, mainly because it was a late development from a Soviet weapons engineering, and then the whole Soviet Union collapsed, and they didn't really have as much military budget to make more of those. But one thing you can see is that it actually lacks a tail rotor, and it is kept stable by two central rotors spinning in opposite directions, and turning is controlled by uh, 
well, adjusting to spin off those rotors in relation to each other, this actually makes it uh, more stable than a helicopter setups using tail rotors. No, I'm not usually such a weapons enthusiast, but enthusiast, but it's I'm personally quite the uh, Hokum interesting. Okay. Now, uh, actual mission. Oh, yeah. There's one of those Guardian guns. There's these rails on top of the walls, which they uh, move on. And actually, cash can get squashed by them running over, which I don't know, strikes me a bit. Weird. So mainly you are supposed to draw the fire runner. At the same time. Make sure they do not run him over. And they have a variety of guns. This one appears to have somewhat of a smaller band. But a higher rate of fire. And also we have we need to be careful cash doesn't get shot by those. That stuff that's down on the ground. Oh boy. See you there on my first pass. Mm, yeah. The camp Hokum is uh, using the Hokum is makes this easier since it has an even bigger weapons loadout and more armor. But it doesn't really look seem to feel all that sluggish. Unlike that you 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 are forced to controlling the first mission. I do believe this Guardian can use as yet a third kind of weaponry. And looks like there's enemies down on the ground there which are shooting at me. Oh yeah, those Too much punishment. <coughs> okay, now about this. And this looks to use the same kind of cannon as the first one. Okay, that's armor. I think I can take this before hack. And I mean, cash enters the danger zone. Yeah. Okay, he's in. Now uh, the cannon to the opposite direction. And he's out and you my sir, good sir are dead. One more I believe. And there's ammunition right. Fuel here. Good. Okay. Cash. Idiot. 
Give it up, Colonel Lamont. You're in a no-win situation. This is a stand-down order. There will be no peace in the world until peace is imposed upon the world. Oh, so you're going to incinerate millions of innocents? Innocents? There are no innocents! What pirate could exist were it not for the complicity <laughs> of his people? You ignorant, misguided fool! My idea of peace does not include having its terms enforced by a lunatic. Whoops, something went wrong with the recording there. Well, you just missed up maybe 20 seconds of gameplay footage or so. I managed to pick up cash and get some more armor and fuel. And now the next mission is to destroy ICBMs. Destroy three ICBMs. But as you can see, we have six targets on, on the map. Now only three of those will contain ICBMs, the other three will trigger ambushes. We got to take out the SS-24s while they're still in the silos. There should be a safety release on the blast door. It's not elegant, but it could work. Get me there. It's possible they might automatically co launch when the blast doors are jimmy. Stay close, Chief. And... Well, all of those will... And it is completely randomized which contain actually which actually contain the missiles. <coughs> but before we get to that, let's do some more housekeeping. Oh hello. I didn't remember there have been enemy helicopters here. Now would you please? Okay, just two more. But I only have one missile. I'm not sure I do. How about use one of the wing tips? Right now. We have these bunches of enemies clustered together from when those enemy reinforcements got in. I've just abused this bug of shooting them in a straight line from outside there. Well, I guess you could call it aggro range. <coughs> and I'll do the same for these enemy turrets here. Hmm. Commander, we've completed all the airdrops. Your final supplies are on the north side of the palace. General, something's kicked in here. I'm reading heavy movement inside the perimeter. I guess we already took care of that movement. Oh, and if you destroy the first... Destroy Lambda with the enemies behind it, they will move ahead. Like so. Like lamps to the slaughter. Yeah, this may be cheap, but hey, I don't really care at this point. Concentrations without within the peri perimeter. Okay, looks like they were. Okay, now let's resupply some. Don't need armor. Don't need fame. 
don't need no credit card to ride three train. And I leave this bunch here for the mission finale. Also, I have never found a big ladder in this mission. Oh, let's drop her off here. And nope, this was not correct. Which is, you can easily tell. And quickly. Wait. Was an ICBM. The target is New York City. In five minutes, it'll be a crater. When the smoke clears, nobody's gonna care what good we did here. If there's anybody left, they'll just remember the one that got away. Return to home base, Commander. Whoops. <laughs> 